back to Warcraft Alliance and Hall, WAH. Currently in a replay at the moment, but I wanted just to quickly show some new maps that have come out. Those of you who may have played Wrath of the Lich King might be familiar with these guys. These are the Vrykul. And they are often found living in Howling Fjord, which is what this map is. So we can see that I've just quickly had a game against the AI here. I've got Garrosh Hellscream on the front lines doing a bit of whirlwind action. A bit of a homage to Bladestorm. And I'm against some random AI undead player who's got a load of banshees and a load of ghouls. So, Howling Fjord. What else has it got besides Varicool? It's got Protodrex, which are quite beasty. 1250 HP. And yeah, this is a uh, this is it. <laughs> Let's speed things up just a tiny bit. So what else could I really say about this map? I think it's a 2v2. You can see the mech camps are very he heavily guarded by all these guys. Troll shops over in the corners. And I assume that's at the same at this side as well. That's actually a zeppelin port. So the, the troll shop is at the the both at this end and the mercenary zeppelin ports are down here. Start locations as a 2v2 map. I, I guess that the, a teammate would start right next to you, which is why I took this early expansion here, because it's completely safe. Only one ramp into the main base area, which covers all of this space. A load of random shovel tusk guys here. I killed a couple of them, they gave no experience, no items, so I don't really know what was going on there. Ooh, it's a bit of a fight. I guess I won that one. Wasn't really paying too much attention. So let's just zoom out a little further. Get a bit of a better view of the map. So you can see all the varicle structures and things. It is the main thing that's going on for this race in this uh, this map. So as we can see here, the undead player, he's just having a little go in here at the proto direction stuff with a panda, brewmaster, and it's about to die. So do not underestimate these thief camps. So this is the Howling Fjord 2v2 map. Just type WH and you shall find it. And there's also another one which I shall cover in a second. The other map, as you can tell possibly by the unit I have currently selected, is a frost worm, which I can't seem to zoom in on. Never mind. Anyway, it's Ice Crown. So let's find where I am. Getting chased by some plague hounds by the looks of it. So it looks like I'm also going to turn around and kick the shit out of those things. Flesh beasts. Ice Crown is a 3v3 map, so quite unique in that respect. I have this start location here. I guess another one would be here and the other one here. So it's right across the top and right across the bottom. Bit of a strange access route on this outside section here and here to get to the bottoms. But also, I don't know, keeps things interesting when it's not completely making sense. Got a flesh giant over here. One over here. And I, I just had a quick look at this map to try and figure out where Ice Crown Citadel itself might be. And that's obviously one of the floating necropoli. necropoli. I guess it's this here, but you can't see the frozen throne at the top. So who knows? Either way, this is the new map. So I'll do what I did before, zoom out a bit, speed things up. Oh my god, it's going fast. So you can see, again, I just went against the AI just to showcase the map, basically. Put it on max speed, speed things along very quickly. So you've got things like frost worms, you've got obviously the flesh giants and fresh beasts that I showed earlier. There's also a bit more going on with the Vrykul sort of um, side of things, as they also live in Ice Crown. You can see a few of them here with their wolf pets. Got a troll shop over here. You've got the mercenary camps, do you have them? Yep, here they are. Protected by Frosty, Vrykul and Protodrakes and all that kind of thing. Quite a lot of them in fact. 
and then the Zeppelin fort just across there from the mercenary camp as well. That is a whoa! That is a lot of rangers. Holy crap! So I went with a Mountain King and a Paladin, wherever the hell that guy got to. And I think I'm about to lose the Mountain King. Yep, yeah, there he goes. But the uh, first hero I took out was actually the Paladin. If I can manage to, the easy way to do it. There he is. So he's got like this massive shield wall effect because he's one of the items he has. He's got holy light, divine storm, and a couple of levels of judgments to do some nuking, which he's got to do on that there beastmaster down he does. So obviously the AI it's not too much of a challenge, but I just wanted to quickly show this map and because this is new, it's a good chance that people don't really know about this one. So Ice Crown. W A H is what you want to be searching for if you wish to find this map along with the uh, Howling Fjord as well as the old ones which would be Ashenvale, Ebersong Forest and the Crossroads. So do look for this map if you like RTS games that in the Warcraft theme because it needs a lot of more support in order to get more recognition so we can get faster queue times. Thanks for watching and goodbye.